Hello everybody and welcome to a brand new game. I've realised I haven't played any sort of new game since I think I Am Bread, which was ages ago, which is absolutely appalling to say I'm a gamer. I haven't played any sort of new games on my channel apart from just Minecraft, so that's not a new game. So, uh, today what we're going to be playing is The Long Dark. Now this is a survival game, uh, it's made by Hinterland Studio Inc. And yeah, it's basically all about surviving, so uh, it's in early alpha at the moment. There's no story mode, that's as I said, not available in the alpha. Uh, but what I'm going to be playing is we're going to be playing the sandbox mode. Now, there's three different types. There is basically like uh, a pilgrim mode, which basically is uh, just like for exploring, getting to know the surroundings, like animals will attack you. Uh, there's voyager mode, which is basically uh, you're an explorer, you're going to be equal parts, so you're going to be hunted as well as doing the hunting. Um, but yeah, that's basically it, and you can explore while being hunted or hunting, uh, which is I'm gonna, which is what I'm going to be playing today. Or the third mode, which is Stalker. This is like the hard mode. This is like hardcore hard mode. I'm not going to be playing this today because I'm not in hardcore mode. Uh, I want to be a little bit of danger, so we're gonna we're not going to do the pilgrim. That's kind of noobish. Uh, so I'm going to go for Voyager. So we're going to confirm. Uh, we're going to be a man, not a woman. We're going to be a man today. Um, I'm probably going to be screaming like a woman when I start playing this, but yeah, for now we're going to be a man. This is, it is kind of beautiful. I really do like the kind of style of this game. So, here we are. There's a squidoodle in the middle of the forest. Uh, I have played this game for like five or ten minutes just to see what it was like, and I really like it. So, um, yeah, we've got our equipment. It's mine as well. It feels like minus 27. Uh, it's probably around that. Uh, these are sort of like my inventory. I've got my equipment. I've got my first aid. Uh, I've got my calories and stuff like that, and I've survived for seven minutes so far. When I did play this before, I managed to find myself a little cabin. So I'm hoping uh, that I try and find something like that. I'm hoping that I try and find a shelter. I don't really want to be uh, out in the wilderness um, we're, we're next to these bunny rabbits. Oh, here we go. This is kind of like a like a little bit of a cabin. Uh, there's a few bunny rabbits like hopping about, which is good. There's, there's a bit of food for me uh, if I can build some traps and stuff like that. This is Deadfall area. Wonderful. <laughs> Not only is it a cabin, but it's just absolutely like there's no... There's, yeah, there's, there's there's no walls. Why is there no walls on this place? And what time is it? Do I even know the time yet? Um, no. Oh, we, oh, there we go. It's it's basically seven o'clock in the morning, so it's bright and early. We've got a full day ahead of us. Can we salvage anything? Okay, so we've got a hatchet already. Uh, a small one-handed hatchet, good for splitting wood. Uh, can't be used to hack meat in a pinch. Ooh. I need to find something a bit more proper because this is terrible. This is such a terrible. Uh, it's not even got a roof on it. That's not going to help me if wolves come. So. Um, what do I need to do now? I could do with getting some equipment out. So, if I can, hmm, harvest? Okay, no, I'm not going to harvest that. I could do with equipping it, but I think you can only, like, actually equip it when you're going to be, uh, basically chopping down trees and stuff like that. It's not a weapon. So, we're going to leave Dead Falls, no matter how pretty amazing it is. Uh, we're going to go on the search for a warmer, more homely cabin. I wonder <laughs> if we're going to be able to find it in this place. Uh, it, I am pretty cold actually. I guess I can't really let my get my cold get that high. Otherwise, I'll probably die. You see, I'm very new to this game, so I don't really know if I can die from cold. Like, if I get too cold, I'll just basically die of like hypothermia or something. So I'm just gonna have to keep going. I'm hoping that the sun comes out and warms me up a little bit. I'm hoping that I'll find a cabin of some sort or maybe some clothes. The calories are going down like crazy. Do I have anything to eat? Please say I have something to eat. Uh, let's check my equipment. These are like the things that I've landed with. So we've got food. We don't, we don't have any, we got, hmm. Okay, we don't have any food, do we? No, we don't have any food whatsoever. So it is going to be quite important to try and find some food of some sort. We need to really, do need to find something. There does seem to be this red thing in the distance. Oh, cabin. Okay, we found the cabin. We have found the cabin. This is good. This is good. What have we got there? It's a wolf. There's a wolf ahead. I'm hoping that he attacks the... Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Go on. Don't. Don't. Is he gonna, who's gonna win? Who's gonna win? <laughs> oh, I wonder if I can take the deer hide off him before he does. I just need to... Can I? Oh, no! I did it! What? My, my mouse! What's happened? Oh, he's run away. Okay. Um. Oh, I guess I can... I can harvest the meat. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. How long is it taking him? It's taking him like 15 minutes to have his meat. Okay, cool. That is done. Hide. I'm not sure I'm gonna make it. 
harvester hide because um yeah we can make some armor maybe i don't know we can at least make some something to get warm and the good thing i like about this game is it's kind of like kid friendly so like there's no like it doesn't show like that much to like harvest stuff like in some games it's really brutal with the way like it kind of does things like nature if you know what i mean like if you're harvesting like an animal like it properly shows it um yeah like butchering an animal and yeah this game doesn't really do that it's kind of like a nice cool little uh, survival game but i really like the graphics but anyway let's go inside the camp office it's really dark in here for some reason look there's not much windows but oh there's an obsessed bit okay right it was an armchair as well right let's okay what have we got around here we need to try and find some stuff hello what is around here? Oh, there's some stuff down here. So we've got a can opener. Needs this anymore. An implement for opening cans. I'll take that. A candy bar. There we go. Uh, eat. We've gained 250 more calories. It must have been something like a lion bar. Pork and beans. Beans, blah, blah, blah. Uh, condition 34%. Uh, do we need it? I don't know. I'm going to take it just in case we need it. We probably are going to need it when we get hungry. Uh, filing cabinet. Okay, what have we got in here? It's going to search them. A woolly hat. I'm going to take that. All right, nothing in that. Anything in this one? There is a newspaper roll. Okay, that'll do. More scrap metal. There is a crafting bench around the corner, so we could even try and craft some... Maybe some traps or something like that. I'm not sure yet. Right, uh, let's carry on going. What have we got here? We haven't even named our character yet. We don't even know what he's called. Maybe we should name him. I feel like we'll have a better chance of surviving uh, if we name the character. I just had a quick look at the controls. Uh, I think I know everything already, so it doesn't really matter. But we have to call this character Bob. I think Bob is a valiant name for an explorer. So we're going to call him Bob. Bob is an awesome name. Right, so we've got a lantern. What's this on the floor here? We've got another newspaper roll. Some more reclaimed wood. Um, what's this? It's just a workbench. Right, we're gonna have a look at crafting in a minute. But for now, I want to see if we can make a fire because we do have matches. We've got loads of matches. We've got tinder. We're gonna use the newspaper and let's use the firewood and start the fire. Here we go. We can finally get toasty and warm. It's been freezing outside for so long. It's gonna take us a while to start the fire though, but look at this glow. It's, it's amazing. Oh. I can feel it on my computer monitor. My face is getting warm. Oh. But yeah, finally get a fire. I think also we might have a bed on us, which is super awesome. So we can put the bed down. This can be this can be Bob's home, the Bob cabin or the babin. Yeah, the babin. We're gonna call it the babin. Uh, pot belly stove. There we go. Fire starting skill increased to 51, and I believe the bedroll. Oh, look at this. Oh, Bob's little, Bob's little, um, yeah, his little sleeping bag. Look at this. It's a bobbing bag. There we go. The Bob roll. <laughs> so we've got 50 minutes left on the fire. I really start, I want to start getting this cold down. It's still only 10 o'clock in the morning. We haven't even survived a, wait, we survived three hours, but we need to survive a day at least. All right, let's see what we do on the workbench. Let's see what else we've got. So we can craft bear skin bed rolls, a deer skin, a fishing tackle, a hook, which we can. So a fishing tackle, we need a hook and a line. We don't have a line yet. But we do. We can, oh, we can make a fishing rod. Okay, this is good. I might make a fishing rod. Let me see what else we've got. Uh, rabbit mitts, snares. Ooh. Ooh, we should try and make a trap. Okay, we can either fish or we can try and make a trap. Now, I haven't seen any... I haven't seen any sort of ponds yet or lakes to fish in. I might make a fishing rod. There, there must be something, otherwise it wouldn't say it. So let's let's begin crafting. I'm going to try and make a fishing rod. Oh, sorry, Mike. I'm going to try make a fishing rod and try and go fishing somewhere. So we've got a hook. We've got a fishing tackle. Uh, we need to make a line first, which is a gut. We've already made the hook. So if we craft the line, we can put both together, make a fishing rod, and then we can go outside... And we can try and find some fish because we need to get full. So, begin fish. Well, not begin fish. Begin crafting fish. This is going to be awesome. I want to see what it looks like if we can actually see it. So, we should have a fishing rod now. Should we not? Equipment. Um, What we got? We got a hook and a fishing tank. A hook and a line. You just catch fish. There we go. We got it. So, 
what we need to do now is we need to go back outside. We've got no cold. Our fatigue is creeping up our hunger and our thirst. So we could do with finding some other stuff on the travels. We could do with maybe uh, getting to a lake and maybe getting some, um, getting some water and stuff like that. So... I think for now what we should do is we're going to quickly eat the... Let's eat the... Mm, ooh, that's got 900 calories. That's crazy. Okay. Well, I'm going to eat this because this is going off. Uh, open can with can opener. There we go. And then we're going to eat this. This should get our hunger right down. And then we're going to go outside, see if we can fish. There we go. Eating plus 600 calories. There we go. This should be enough. We've got our cold down. Our hunger's gone down. We just need water now. We are running out of water, so we need to go outside. Ooh, what's this? There's a first aid kit on the wall. Okay. Sewing kit. Required to craft and repair clothing. This is good. What else? An energy bar. That is awesome. We can do water. Bandage. That'll do. Right, we're going to go out the back door. We're going to try and find a lake. As I say, we have got pretty much everything we need to fish now. Okay, so this is the back, this is the back of the cabin. I wonder if there's anything... Round the cabin. Pond! I found a lake! Is it frozen though? Do I need to smash it to... I'm probably gonna have to smash it out. Can we... The mystery lake! Whoa! So mysterious. Right. Be careful of the wool squid. I need to try and find myself a hole. There is another cabin over there. That is awesome. Right, um... What do we need to Equipment. We need to go to... Can we, can we, can we harvest? No, we need to fish. We can't fish yet. We obviously can't fish yet because there's no place to actually get in the water, I don't think. Unless there's some place down there. We need to try and make a hole to fish. I'm going to carry on going to this cabin over here. See what we can find. As I say, we do really need to find some water. So this is going to be one of the main priorities. This place is really bright. The screen is like blinding my eyeballs, but yeah, we found some more cabins at least. I hope the wolves don't come on here. There's a deer over there. Whoa! Okay, there's loads of cabins we can explore. This is good. Hopefully we're going to find some more supplies. We've got to remember our cabins that way. We've got the red Canadian flag, so we shouldn't get that lost. Look at this cabin. It's just a small little cabin on its own. Oh, this is nice. What we got here? Fishing hole! 100% frozen. <laughs> I was like, oh, we can break the ice there. This is good. This is good. We're going to break the ice. Let's do it. We can start to fish. This is absolutely awesome. This is crazy. Right. Let's do it. Right. The ice has been cleared, which means we can now fish. But first, I'm just going to check out some of these cupboards. See what we've got anything in them. Nothing. What's this? Whoa. Okay, we've got a rifle bullet. That's crazy. I didn't lose even guns in this game. Uh, nothing up here on these shelves, I don't think. Nope. Uh, draw. Let's have a look in these drawers. Tomato soup. That'll do. Anything in this bottom one? Need water? Got water? Nothing. Okay. Should we see if we can fish? Hours to fish. Okay, let's fish for three hours. Start fishing. Okay, now I'm hoping that we do get... Whoa! There we go. We got ourselves a salmon. Even though it says a bass. We got ourselves a bass. I wanted it to be a salmon. I don't know why. Um, Two kilograms. Nearly three kilograms. Wow, that's a big fish. Okay, let's fish some more. So we got a lake white fish. A common freshwater fish, small but plentiful. I'm going to take everything that I can get here. Okay. What's that noise? Why do I sound like I'm dying? Okay, my condition's at 17%. I really do need to get some water. I'm dehydrated now. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm going to die. I'm going to... You faded into the long dark. <laughs> no! <laughs> I survived for 7 hours and 35 minutes. I really thought that was going well. I can't believe it. I think the only thing that killed me is because I dehydrated. I didn't have enough water. Oh, man. I was doing so well. I had my little cabin and I was, like, searching all of the cabins. I, sh I really should have gone to the other cabins first to find myself some water. But anyway, that was the long dark. It was quite a fun game to play. Uh, I really want to play some more. Let me guys know if you want me to play some more in the comments below. I'll try again and I'll try and survive for at least a day. I only did seven hours. But yeah, hope you have enjoyed this video. My name is Miss and I will see you all later. Bye!